if the ocean gets warm and the atmosphere gets warmer, we're going to lose sea ice. What it means is that there are processes that happen now that will switch off. Things like when sea ice freezes, it forms very cold, heavy water that sinks to the bottom of the ocean and drives a circulation that takes heat from the equator and distributes it to the pole and it takes the cold temperatures from the poles and puts them up to the equator. In the best scenario, that process would be diminished. So the redistribution of the heat on the planet depends to some extent on sea ice. Sea ice is white. That means it reflects energy if it's on the ocean. And if the ocean is dark, then the sun's energy gets absorbed. So the ocean with sea ice on it will be kept cooler than the ocean without sea ice. Sitting on top of Antarctica is a huge um, ice sheet up to four kilometres thick in places. Um, and that is made up of glaciers that gradually slide out towards the ocean. When they get there, instead of carving off into icebergs, they form what are called ice shelves. Big, huge, floating shelves of ice. Uh, the Ross Ice Shelf covers an area approximately the same size as New Zealand. And these ice shelves hold back that ice from rolling off the continent. If they start to change their behaviour, then there's potential that that ice will come off Antarctica faster and therefore contribute to sea level rising in a faster way. This season I'll be driving out onto the sea ice from Scott Base, drilling holes through the ice, so that's about two metres of solid ice. And then I'm particularly interested in the sort of slushy ice that's forming underneath that. Um, looking for water that's coming out from underneath the ice shelves. And right here where we are, we've got the coldest water that naturally occurs on the planet. So that's what we're looking at in particular. That coldest water on the planet is a sure sign that we've got an influence of from the ice shelf. So this is melted ice shelf water. So just the fact that sea ice has been expanding, you know, that sounds like a, a contradiction in a warming climate. But what it could potentially be a signal of is that those big ice shelves are actually potentially melting faster. <laughs> <laughs>